I have a hot point Aquilty's washer dryer. The start slash pause button indicator light is flashing and won't start the cycle when pressed. Nothing is happening. Turned the machine off and waited 10 minutes to see if the machine will reset but still the machine won't start the cycle and the button is still flashing. Hi, I'm Daniel welcome to Just Answer, I'm reviewing your question now and will post back with your reply momentarily. Can you post the model number please? Act 1170DIS slash N hash 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 Thanks for that. If you turn the dial round does the light change on the cycles as you turn it? Also if you press any of the other touch buttons do these respond to being pressed? The light moves to the different cycle when you turn the dial but when you press any of the touch buttons nothing happens. Thanks for that. If it's not starting and not responding to the start button being pressed then it may be the touch control at fault here. If this is something you are looking at fixing then you need to open the door and on the inside you will see a plastic cover held on with a few screws. Make sure this is unplugged and then remove the cover. Once this is off look at the back of the control board and there you will see the membrane ribbon pushed into the back of the control board. It's the clear plastic ribbon so pull it off the board and you will see it bends round. Inspect it on the bend and see if Therese cracks on there. As these can split and break on the bend. If this is the case then I'm afraid the complete door will need to be replaced. As the touch control pad is part of the door and if this fails the door will need to be replaced. This is something we see a on these as they see a break on the membrane on there where it bends. So check that if you can and see what you find from there and let me know. Check that everything is okay. We had a problem before it came up as F5 and pump was blocked and my husband remove a small sponge from the pump filter. I spinned and drained it twice and then it emptied but since then it has not worked. Does it need reprogrammed? I've seen them before where it needs reprogramming but if this is the case what happens is the door locks and the pump runs all the time. So as to the fault when you press the start button does it do anything at all? Does the door lock? Did you get the last message? Machine previously showed F5 pump drain was blocked with small sponge. Drain cleared pressed pump drain cycle twice and then after this this that previously described has happened and it won't start its cycle. The door is okay. No issue. Is it that it needs reprogrammed? No the door won't lock. It's does nothing a number 55357 semicolon and number 56897. It's possibly it needs a reprogram but this is something you cannot do yourself. As you need the Hotpoint laptop in order to reprogram as it's all done by a computer. So if it's not starting at all and the ribbon cable in the door is fine then it's a control board issue. It's either a faulty board or it needs reprogramming. But as I said you will need to get Hotpoint in to do this as it has to be done by their laptop I'm afraid. Now they charge a fixed price repair of £130 all I for appliances under 5 years so for that they will call out and replace the board if needs be and program it up. Sorry it's not the news you wanted to hear but these machines are a nightmare to fix when it's an electronic fault as Therese nothing we can do as even us engineers don't have access to the hot point laptops. Thanks we'll just need to get them out. 
If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.